If you're wondering how you can win this bike, check out the link in the description box. What's up guys, Sean here from SRKCycles.com. We have a 2000, it's like a 15 or something. 2015 victory and I, I saw a hammer, top, a cue ball, I don't know. It's something. <laughs> it's something. It's a sidecar. Earlier before the video, I sneezed in my helmet. It's it's pretty cool. So this bike has 6,500 miles on it, and it's got a sidecar. And I can't think of a of a, of a lighter feeling bike that has a bigger engine than this that's set up like a sidecar. I mean, it just it's very light feeling. It's like you just do whatever you want to do. It's a lot of fun. Guys, let's start the day with the words of wisdom. 1 Peter 4, 16. But if anyone suffers as a Christian, he is not to be ashamed, but to glorify God in this name. But to glorify God in this name. Is it this name or his name? That sounds right. All right, so we do have a gear indicator on here. We do have a little power supply, which is nice. And if we turn too fast to the right, what's up? Our sidecar will pop up. I wonder if that guy that I just said what's up to, I wonder if he's coming to see us. <clears throat> just to give you an idea of how fast this thing is. Now, to be honest with you, I was a little bit skeptical with this sidecar setup because the bike's only a 2015. The sidecar looks significantly older. It's an older sidecar, that's for sure. Uh, it's been painted a couple times. But it gets the job done. Hey, guys. I'm gonna adjust this lever out. There we go. That is better. This is actually pretty uh pretty nice. I mean it's not fighting you. The thing tracks really straight. They got this thing tuned very well. It's a pretty decent ride. Ooh, I'm excited to hit that roundabout. I'm gonna crush that roundabout, taking that left hand as fast as I possibly can. <clears throat> nah, not that fast. I'll hold back, I'll go to like 70%. <clears throat> so if you ever ridden a sidecar, it's kinda it takes a little while before you really know how fast you can take a, a, a right hand corner. But you can take rights. I mean, you can take left as fast as you want. Except it kind of fights you a little bit, but you can take it. Yeah. Yeah. Get that. Okay, so I, I get the sidecar up like an inch, but in my mind, I'm like this. It's just like when you're doing a wheelie, if you're only used to a little bit, you know what I mean? You, in your mind, it feels like you were riding it for like miles, but you just kind of bloop. Popped it up for like a second, like one inch. <clears throat> That's exactly what it is. This is fun. I mean, that, that sidecar is definitely a lot smaller than the uh, the one on that BTX we have, but it's also a lot lighter. So we got this bike pre we we uh, we got this bike priced out pretty cheap. Uh, basically, what you would just pay for a regular bike for a regular uh, victory like this so think of the sidecar as just kind of an added bonus I mean it's definitely cool it's definitely unique you could ride three people on here think about that you could ride maybe two people in the sidecar this is basically I mean, you could ride three people in here this this will seat more than your Corvette or a Del Sol 
kind of cool to think of. Although one time me and my buddy, me and my buddy Chris, we were working on the car wash and we needed a ride home and this girl was like, yeah, I'll take you home. But she had a Del Sol, so we had to like, two guys, like one guy was sitting in the seat, the other guy was sitting in that little like six inch space behind the seat, like waist up was above the car. It was pretty cool. We got home though. If you guys were wondering if we ever got home, we got home. This thing's a pretty light feeling bike. It's not fighting you or anything when you're riding it. <clears throat> I like it. I'm impressed. Pretty decent platform to put a uh, to put a victory to put a sidecar on. Still, still a little like how fast can I go on those rights? <clears throat> Bam! You see it? I'm up. Alright, hold up. I'm up, I'm up, I'm up. Okay. <clears throat> Man, wild one. Now, it's kind of like what you would expect when you're turning left or right. You don't, you, you actually have to turn the wheel. Which, we, if all you guys who ride, you know, we don't really turn the wheel. We actually kind of push the opposite way and we lean into it. So because the rig is so steep, it just kind of, that's why when they do a tri kit, they actually rake the, the front end up. They rake the front end out a little bit, and it makes it way easier to drive. A million times easier. All right, guys, that wraps it up. This is Sean from SRK Cycles. Remember, check out uh, something. All right, what do I say? I forget. All right, see you guys later. What's up, guys? If you want to check, if you like to see one more content, check up here. And if you want bikes and beards content, check up here. And bikes and beards, win a free bike. Subscribe right here. No!